Persimmon Trees with Miss Hannah. Hi everyone, today I want to talk to you about trees. Not just any kind of tree. First, I want to ask you a question. Do you know what this is? It looks like it's orange on the outside with a green stem. A persimmon. Great job. Do you know what shape this persimmon is? A circle. And what about this size? Is this persimmon big or small? It is a little bit small. You're right. Before we take a look at the inside, I want to ask you another question. Have you ever tried persimmon before? This is going to be my first time trying this persimmon. And I can't wait to do it with you. We're going to learn about persimmons this month. So I wanted to show you the outside and soon the inside of a persimmon. Before we try our persimmon, what do we need to do? Wash our hands. That's a great idea. Washing our hands will help get all the germs off so that none of them go inside of our body when we eat. Let's go. First, I washed my hands, and now I'm ready to cut open my persimmon. I'm gonna use a knife, but I'm gonna be very, very careful. And I'm gonna make sure someone's watching me so I don't hurt myself. First, I'm gonna cut off the stem. Wow. The stem's right here, and this is the inside of the persimmon. Let's cut it open again to see what it looks like. Now that the persimmon is cut open in half, I'm going to cut it one more time so we can get a better look. Ooh. Let's take a closer look. seeds inside of this persimmon? Me either. Maybe if we go a little closer and cut it one more time so we can see what is inside. Now that our persimmon is cut open, we can talk about the inside. What color is the inside? You're right, it's orange, just like the outside of the persimmon. The inside is orange too. I'm going to cut it one more time to see if we can find any seeds. Hmm, do you see any seeds in here, my friends? I don't see any seeds, but I know that persimmons should have seeds. Even though our persimmon didn't have seeds, I want to show you a photo of a persimmon that does have seeds. Can you point to the seeds? I want to ask you, do you think that if something has seeds inside of it, that it's a fruit or a vegetable? I think it's a fruit too. Because fruits have seeds and they grow from the flower of the plant. Eating persimmons will help our bodies get vitamin A to strengthen our immune system and help us fight off sicknesses. And they're good for our eyes too, just like any other orange fruit or vegetable is. Do you remember how persimmons grow? Do they grow on a vine, like a bean? Or maybe in the ground, like carrots and potatoes? No. Right? Persimmons grow on trees. Thanks for reminding me. Persimmons grow on trees. And here's a picture of a persimmon tree. Now that we talked about how persimmons grow on trees, I want to talk about all the ways that we can eat persimmons. Are you ready? 
persimmons can be eaten plain, like an apple. You can make a persimmon pudding. You can cut them up and put them in a salad. Or you can make them into a bread, a sweet bread. Wow, those persimmons look amazing. I can't wait to have one for myself. Eating persimmons will help you get vitamin A to strengthen your immune system and help your eyes so you can see better. Persimmons also have a lot of fiber in them. And fiber helps keep our heart strong. Eating lots of fruits and vegetables help make us healthy because they have a lot of nutrients that help us to grow big and strong. Do you know any other orange fruits or vegetables that will help us be healthy? Those are great ones. There's orange, papaya, bell peppers, cantaloupe, carrots. These are all delicious fruits and vegetables. Thanks for talking about persimmons with me today. Now we know that persimmons are orange, that they grow on a tree, and they have lots of nutrients that help us stay healthy. So don't forget to eat your persimmons. Until next time.